Yo, 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 yo. This is your boy, Black Rambo. Um, this is my second video uh, of Grand Theft Auto 5. I'm pretty much going to show you guys about the customization shops up and you know how, you know, how serious it is, how much work you put into it. So, this is a pretty good car. I stole it from somebody, of course. I mean, who buys cars on Grand Theft Auto? I mean, give me a fucking break. Anyway, uh, so the cops on my ass for a second, you know, I killed all of them, jumped into the pool or the ocean or whatever the fuck it is, and fucking lost them. So, I'm almost there to the uh, customization shop. You know, I'm just gonna go in the cut. You know, make sure you guys see how badass this car is. You know, see that, that baby? Beautiful. Well, except for that blood stain on the top. Don't pay attention to that. They haven't got nothing to do with the guy I killed. Take it. Um, yeah, so fuck that blood thing. Don't worry about it. The, the top card is red. He just spray paint extra red. It's not a blood thing. Even though I told you it was. Don't worry about that. Right. So, we're in here, of course, and I'm gonna repair it. Getting rid of that, uh, blood stain. <laughs> uh, and you see it have a number of categories in which you can, uh, upgrade. So, the first thing that I'm gonna do is respray it. Because I love my cars to have the color that I want them to have. I don't want it to have any other type of color, you know. It's gonna be my fucking color or no fucking color. You see, you feel me? Yeah, you feel me. But I ain't gotta explain shit. So I want it to be chrome. And you see how slick and sexy that looks, you know. I can pick up hella hookers with, that, with this car. Um, so I pretty much colored it how I want to color it, of course. Uh, skirts. Skirts is, are beautiful, you know. I love bitches with many skirts. But, well, in my case, you know, my bitch classy, so she got a head adequately long skirt, you know, hide the goodies, leave enough for the imagination, you feel me, you know, you don't have everything hanging out, you want to have enough, you know, that you can, you know, wonder about, you know, you want to wonder about shit, and so this is the tail, uh, I pretty much want one, because they're sexy, so I'm going to get one, turbo, do not know how to use the fucking turbo, so I'm not going to buy it, I'm not going to buy the turbo, repeat, I am not going to buy the turbo, um, I'm buying new tires, you know, I like my old tires, but for the sake of this video, I'm gonna switch it up. Let me know how you should think about the tires right away in the comments, you know, don't hold back, be brutal, because I'm told I'm a terrible tire picker. Terrible. Anyway, I'm gonna change my wheel color, and my wheels have to be either red, black, or this badass uh, salmon pig. I don't know why, it just looks so sexy on my wheels. Especially when the blood gets on. I'm sorry, I might as well be talking about that. Um, yeah, but you'll find out why this is called Doom and Gloom and why this is in the Doom and Gloom section. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, it's a must to have bulletproof tires, but since I don't have any money right now, I'm really not gonna go for that. But we could check out some other stuff. So they have ways of pretty much improving the speed, durability, and capabilities of your car, i.e., suspension. So this will, this will pretty much get your traction on one point. You know, those sharp turns where you can't quite cut it. This will do. That'll do that for you. You know, that suspension, license plates. You know, this is a little little thing. You know, a little added touch. I always go with the black and yellow. I'm a Ravens fan, but. This black and yellow just looks so sexy, I can't help it. So, we're gonna go to lights. Again, little things. We got sock lights, then we got those xenon LED lights. Don't those look good? Yeah, great for spying on people when you know chasing and running them down. You know, you're about to kill them. Excuse me, I might kill anybody, but I just wanna make that known. Um, hood. I prefer a smooth hood because you know when bodies roll over top of your car, it's no resistance, it's just smooth. You know, like pieces of hair and chipped teeth and bones don't get caught all up in your, uh, you know, your shit. You feel me? Yeah. And something like this, something like this wouldn't be bad, but it's just fucking up the look of my heart. It's not really, but I don't want to deal with it, so I'm not going to deal with it. Exhaust. You got to have the exhaust. You see, the exhaust is pretty much going to, uh, it's like, it's like a little added fuck you to the person you run over because then you, you know your fumes it's like a major fart on their face it's like it's excellent I love it you gotta have the big bore exhaust you know you got bore shit on the nigga anyway so if you want your car to outrun those motherfucking cops or if you want to get out the car and use your grenade launcher to blow the fuck out of them cool coolio you can do that just make sure you get that engine upgrade you feel me anyway bumpers you get that bumper up Brakes, 
them sports breaks. I ain't got no money for them sports breaks, but when you get that money, you get those sports breaks. Armor is a must. If you don't hook up that armor, you most certainly will die. I do not want to go through this with you people. Get your car's armor up. Um, let's head to the windows. We check out the windows so you can head and tent it. Super tent it. No super tent it. That's like secluded shit. If you a homo or something, you know, you get those windows and you go get you a homo hooker. But for me, I like my shit like, like clear, you know. I want to see that bitch sucking me off, you feel me? I, I, I don't want nothing hitting. Anyway. Let's leave and you know get back to my gleam and gleam part of this uh, video. You see how those salmon wheels just sparkle when they come out and how my uh, car just gleams? Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my map and I'm going to plot a course for my garage. This is the, uh, you know, my Grove Street garage pretty much, you know, you know, CJ, all that good shit, but CJ ain't there no more. Well, not that I know of, his old ass not making an appearance, but I don't care because I ain't got nothing to do with that anymore. Anyway, so I'm driving, smoking and driving, you feel me? Um, and before I get there, you know, I've got to create a bit of doom and gloom. You know, I can't just have this car being spotless, so I'm going to hit you. Yeah, you see that? No resistance. He just flew right off, right off the top. You know, he was a chubby one, I guess he doesn't count. I got to try somebody else. Uh, 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 uh. Ram that nigga. Uh, uh, uh. Crush that bitch. Damn, she got a frog. Uh, uh. Anyway. Oh, you want a bus stop? Not no. Ooh, you lucky. Ooh, mm, you got away. You, you a bus riding nigga. You, you be running from people, don't you? Oh, you motherfucker. You see, I hate being stopped by a pedestrian. Yeah, pedestrians piss me off. Like this nigga. Get, 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 get the fuck up. Get the fuck up, kid. You, if I'm coming, just die. Just die. Just die. Now nah, I'm gonna you know, make a turn. I didn't let the cops turn me. But I don't give a fuck. I just don't give a fuck. If they pop up, I'm gonna just shoot them. It's just that simple, you know? It is just that simple. I was planning on picking up a hooker for you guys, you know, you could see I was planning to really enhance the mood. You know, they just make you feel like you're at home. Or, you know, that's what people tell me, or I, I tell other people. Uh, you know, I used to live in my car for a little about. Oh, no, you didn't. Uh, you made me miss my turn, you bitch. You lucky I'm trying to get this car in here. I'm going to blow your ass up. Uh, okay. Open up. Right. I'm in my garage. You guys aren't going to see any of my crazy ass car in here. You're just going to uh, see the garage. So I'll give you guys a good look at some of the good shit that GTA has to offer. Now, next time you come into this garage... Oh, okay, there's one of my uh, greasy cars. I got other cars, but they were just other people. I haven't really gotten a chance to customize you yet, but when I get some more dough, I will. Look at that. That's a prime example on why you need uh, armor. Oh, look at my face. Oh, niggas gotta die. Niggas gotta die. And they got my long jaw messed up. Uh-oh, shit is getting real. Anyway... This concludes episode 2 of Doom and Gloom, stationed at the uh, Grove Garage and the Los Santos Customs Park. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and uh, peace out, you know? It's that button nigga shit, for real.